In a few sentences, can you tell me what audience can expect to see and why they should come out and see Mechanic Resurrection? Uh, it's a huge action movie. It's Jason Statham at its best and it's sort of like a dirty James Bond. Yeah? So the mechanic is traveling all over the world. We have exotic locations, incredibly action and he shows some feelings for the first time. So the mechanic is falling in love. We have a little love story which with the action is just gorgeous and great. Fun to watch. Now, in the first movie in 2011, that was based on the 70s movie, on the original. Now, doing a movie that's the sequel, we don't know what to expect. In the first one, we kind of already knew what the storyline was. Yeah. But in this one, you know, you're already saying a little bit love. What, what can people expect to see further in the storyline that they didn't get in Mechanic 1? <laughs> I think the, the biggest fun in Mechanic 1 was just like that he tries to kill people and it always has to look like an accident and right now we see a little bit more of that and we see uh, because the people here he has to kill are incredibly hard to get to yeah so the preparation is insane because we know how can he do it it's unbelievable yeah those guys are on a, on a secret prison island yeah they are in a fortress in the sky how can he pull it off yeah and just to to watch him do the preparations is a lot of fun now how much of uh, Jason did his own stunts in this movie because I know he's very known for doing a lot of the stunts but it, uh, just in one scene in the beginning he's like cutting a circle of a pool that's yeah. what f 50 yeah. stories high now uh, did he do that himself yeah. or it's all him it's unbelievable this guy I mean like if he's a superstar but if not he would be one of the best stuntmen working in the industry today yeah he's incredible yeah he his he knows so much about stunt action design body language actually I think he could direct an action film movie himself and a good one yeah he's he's that good yeah. oh wow if i get a chance to talk to jason tonight i'm going to tell him you said that he's going to take that as a huge compliment now what movie should he direct now give him an example okay so when i talk to him so he gets an <laughs> idea all right i hope he will be james bond one day and then he should direct his own james bond movie and it will be incredible yeah <laughs> We're giving that tidbit out to the studios, putting it out there, right? What was your favorite part about shooting this movie? I mean, like you said, there's so many different locations, all these amazing stunts. Was there a favorite moment for you? I must say, just shooting on the beach in Thailand. I'm a huge fan of Thailand and just to work with, there with the crew, it's, it's a special place, it's a magic place. For example, we shot in the prison and uh, the Thai people said, we, we don't go there at nine. I said, why? Because it's haunted, yeah? So, and then and the next day you are on, on, on the beach and you have like a special Buddhist ceremony just to say, okay, we come to this place and we, we just, we disturb the peace for a few days because we are shooting an action movie. Um, uh, give us the peace, yeah, and the stuff. So that was interesting. It, it, the cultural um, learning for me was, was big on this one.